tour for my new mansion. And um, just so you guys know, and some of the parts of the house, I did um, see some on um, It's Nora. And she's a very, um, it's a great channel and stuff. So make sure you go check out um, her video and stuff. And that's how I got some of the parts of my house. So let's get started. And if you guys see this little um, gray dot here, I have a mouse and um, this is my mouse here. So first here we have our little like lock for our door. And then um, we have, I don't know what these are, but they're just something. And then a little note thing and a table. And then over here, if you've seen it, not, I haven't made it, but in some videos or just in shorts or something, um, you can make a homemade stroller. And I tried my best to make one right here. So this is it. It has like big bottles, small bottles, um, the little part where the baby goes in. I do have a baby now. I've, because if you guys seen my recent video, I did do a role play. Um, and make sure you guys go, guys go check that out because last time I checked, I only had three views. So yeah. Um, but here is the office, the dad's office. Um, I'm just calling them like dads or moms or something because I haven't figured out all their names yet. So we have like lights and we have this little table here. The bottom floor is a lot of what it Nora it's Nora does. Um so yeah. And she did say you can copy it, so you can go to her channel. Um, um there's a little picture right here that you guys can go check out so yeah and we got some paintings from because he does have two little daughters so there's some paintings and then we have like a little uh, two plans this has nothing in it because a lot of these things have are just like decoration and then inside of here is paperwork and books and then again this bottom drawer is just for looking and if we take the father out this is a new chair i'm not 100 percent sure but i'm pretty sure this ch chair did come with the mansion i'm just gonna name some stuff though because so then you guys can see if you want to make it and then there's a trash can of course um there is a mask to go with this i just don't know where it went so yeah now we're gonna go along. We do have a puppy here. I don't know its name, so make sure you guys comment down below names from the mother, the father, um, and all the trads that will be coming up, and this dog. We do have another dog. Um, in my other video, um, it was that little dog, that little white dog, named Lucy. I don't know if I'm gonna keep Lucy, so comment down below, below <laughs> more names for that. So this is a little painting of a cat, clubhouse sign, and then a little thing that you can hold like your backpacks and coats, because even though there's no coats in the game. And then comment down below if you guys also know how to put stuff in the elevator, because I don't know how to put stuff in the elevator. I've seen people put benches and stuff, but I just can't do that. So maybe it's just something you can't do on mobile or something, but I don't know. Okay, so here is our living room. We got this big tree, like it's a cat tree, even though we have no cats, but sometimes dogs can like cat things, you know? And then we have a gaming gaming setup here with a TV. And then we have our little couch with a little table here. I do really love these tables though. It's kind of pretty and stuff. I'm also pretty sure I got this in the, um, the kit that came with this house. But I'm not 100% sure. And then here is our kitchen. Because it's a mansion. These people probably are rich, right? So they do have their own cook here. Also come down uh, below a name for him as well. And so here we have our um, little kitchen. And these little... Oh my God. These little um, compartments are a whole 
bunch of different meals that I thought of. And I don't know if you guys knew this too. I did not know rice and um, uh, shrimp could make sushi. I did not know that. So we just have a whole bunch of stuff like like lasagna, salad, just a whole bunch of seafood, sushi stuff, breakfast egg stuff. Um, these are two that are from one of the things of the boxes. Like, let me show you guys if I can get that. Because right. you guys know there's these little boxes here from the um thing. It's the beetroot like cozy restaurant. I'm pretty sure it's called. And I got these these um these two top ones um from this one. So. If you guys want to check out, there's a lot of meals in them. I've tried to make every single meal, even though there's not a lot, and it's not really good to survive on them, but they are very cool and uh, nice. So next we have, because we do have a baby, um, there's a little cup for the baby and stuff, because, you know, babies can't eat from plates yet. I, she probably, because I don't know how old she is yet. Um, but she is, but I don't even think she'll be able to eat solid foods. So now we also have a little, um, thing for, um, pasta. And we also have a knife and a little thing to flip if we do, like, things. And then we also have our drawer here. Let me move her. Of, like, our, um, cups and our plates for everyone. And then down here is, oh, well, then I must throw this away or something, um, because there's then more of these down here, bowls and cups that are a set that she got, and the baby set, the little playhouse thing, I forgot what it's called, and if we want to bring, like, little things around the place, like, have a, like, little, sorry about that noise, but have little, bring things over it. Um, on a big plate like servers do. I can't think of it right now. Um, but that's what it is. And then we have, I know it has a little pet thing on it, but it is the baby's diaper bag. It obviously has diapers, little, um, stuff to put on her little butt. <laughs> and then we have a little napkin, and down there are some diapers. And then we have a little pack of diapers here, so then we can restore it whenever we need but we also have another one upstairs that I'll show you in her little room that she has. And then we have a um, water bottles for everyone. And we also have a little thing that we can put water in. Like, um, put it back. Like, put water in it. And then we also have our tea set here. Um, like, as you can tell, there is, like, a little toddler who drinks out of water bottles and stuff and gets her own plate. But I only have three little cups for the older son and then the parents because i don't think like a three-year-old is gonna drink coffee yet and then we have a plant and then we have another garbage can because you know sometimes you want to throw away your food after because your kids don't eat them all and then here's our dining room so we have a seat for the baby and then we have like chairs for the older people on this bullet bulletin board up here, I have not um, put everything in here because you can tell there's a side here that has nothing in it. But then there's this little thing here. So I'll come to a little wood else I should also put on here because even though I don't have a lot of stuff, that I'm trying to buy everything. But it's a lot of money because one of the packs is $16, 15 or $16. I already have five of the houses in it anyway, so, yeah. And now we're going to move on to the bathroom. So, I don't know if it's just me or something, but I love bathrooms. I just love decorating them because there's a lot of things that you can put in them, and it's really fun. So, we have a little so soap. I know it says shampoo, but... It's okay. So we can put this on our hands and start washing it. You guys don't know the hack. You can put a sink behind and then you can put like a little cabinet. So it's kind of like a sink and a cabinet on the bottom. 
which I really think that's really cool. And then we also have a little sponge that we can wash our hands with or just scrub around the place if something gets pretty dirty. So first we have our face masks here because we have up here, um, we have little um, robes for them. So you can, so the mother or the tiny toddler can just have a relaxing time with the mask on and a robe and just relax if she needs to. Or the father can. And then down here is a very chaotic thing. This is probably out of my whole entire house. This is probably the most filled drawer that I have. I don't know why. It's probably not that filled compared to a lot of people I've seen. But we have our toothbrushes. We have shampoo. We have that little stuff for your butt again. Um, we have toothpaste. We have so these four things that I, if you see, I'm circling here. I can circle them too. Um, they they're from the hairstylist place. That um, you can just grab them. They're really nice. Even though I hate when I lift up the hair pro, I'm not gonna lift it up because it's pretty annoying. Because it makes the weirdest sound ever. And it never stops. So, yeah. And then we have a straighten iron, a curling iron, and a thing that we can blow dry our hair. Because if the mom's getting out of the shower, she can't have wet hair for the whole day, right? And then, of course, the most important part of the bathroom, we have the toilet. And we have a light here. And then we also have a shower. I'm also thinking, though, um, when I saw the video from It's Nora, um... I noticed she put like a shower and a bath together. I thought that was really good, like a really good idea. But then I also realized I don't have like a silver head thing for the shower. I only have a gold one, so it looked pretty weird. So I'm probably gonna add a bath or something to see if I can do that with to make this so then you're not always taking a shower and you at least can take a bath. And then we have a little rug here that you can put your feet down so you don't make the floor super wet and then here we have our washing um washer and dryer place so it's not the best because i don't have a washer and dryer so comment down below the pack where you can get that because i spent a lot of time trying to find it and i couldn't so i just searched up a video to see what i can do here so we have a little washer thing that i try to think that could wash the clothes a little and then we have a little thing, um, like a counter here, because up here in the cabinet, I have an iron that I can iron the clothes with. See, because, you know, they get wrinkly when they get out of the dryer and washer. So, yeah. And then we have a towel here. As you guys can see some towels. And actually, I got all of these. If you guys had the hospital, then there is a ton of hospital, a ton of laundry things there. And like the basement and some of the other places. There's a lot. I didn't even get all of them yet. Because um, I used one of them for, because I'm trying to find all the crumpets that I can. Because some of them need packs, like the dump place or whatever it is. Um, has a lot of them, but I couldn't, uh, I couldn't buy it. And then we have a net that we can hang our clothes, so then, I know it's not the best idea, but they will air dry, because there's no thing that I can pretend, or something that it's, um, a dryer. So yeah, and then we got a plant, and then that's it. So yeah, now we're going to head upstairs. Okay, so we made it upstairs now. So now we are going to head um, to the pool area first. So here is another thing. It, um, it's Nora um, did. She like added like a little shower thing. And I was talking about how I couldn't make a bath and shower go together. Because this is the only shower head thing I have. I don't have a silver one. I don't know for sure though. I don't know if I have one or not. I don't. I don't use a lot of stuff in the bathroom because most of the time I don't have enough enough room because I make two bedrooms so then it's really chaotic and just uh. um so we had two chairs for them to sit 
and an umbrella so then they can get some shade from the sun. And then we have two candles here because when it becomes nighttime, it's going to get pretty dark. So we're at it that. And then, of course, a shower so you can wash off all, like, if you want to wash your hair off from all the chlorine and stuff. I wanted to add shampoo and conditioner, but then I was like, I think that's a little too weird. And I don't want to, so, yeah. So then, we move over here, and we have our um, floats here. I also noticed that It's Nora did this as well. And I think it's an amazing idea she put this here so you can do it. But actually, now I think about it, I think I'm going to delete it right now, right here. Because it just takes up a little too much room with the pool and stuff. So then we have a little play area for the kids if they don't want to stay in the pool, but like their parents are in the pool and they or something and they can't go out, so they can play in here. So there's like a slide and some toys up here, blocks, these little frog I don't think they're even frogs. And then we also have these two lights here, if you can see here. We have these two lights because I notice in a lot of pools they have these little lights at the end of their pools that make the whole place bright up, like lit up. So um, that's why I wanted to do that because I know these things do that. At first, I did not even know what these things could do, but then I also realized they can do that. And then and it was just a little room, nothing in there because I don't know what to put in there, and I don't even know what can go in there. So, I wanted to design this place here, but then I just didn't know what to put, because, like, there's so much plants in this house, and sometimes I don't want there's, there to be so much plants. So, yeah. So, next we move on to the parents' bedroom. So, here we have their bed, and then this is just for decoration. It's really just a little cabinet. I don't know what to put in there yet, but I might put some stuff in there, and I'll tell you guys when I do, because it'll probably be in my role play that I'm going to do very soon, but I just want to make sure that the first one I did that you guys should totally go check out is good enough. And then we got a bulletin board. Also, comment down below what I should put on this bulletin board, because I don't know how to put, like, little pictures of, like your characters i don't know how to do that if that's a pack or something so comment down below if that's a pack or if you can tell me how to um um so here's a little living room space again just for decoration here on this cabinet um so here we just have a simple couch and a tv and we have this little let me move up here we have that little flower painting. So then up here, we have all of our thing, all of their clothes. Um, so up here on top is the mom. So it's like kind of her work outfit, just a chill outfit and her PJs. And then this is the dad's work outfit. Just the winter coat because in winter, you're going to get cold and stuff. And then we also have PJs. It doesn't look that bad when it's not on him, but it kind of looks a little weird when it's on him, but that's the only PJ that I um, have. And this is like face masks and stuff. I haven't put that away yet because I just got that. And then here is like some perfume and like skincare stuff. And then the rest of these drawers, nothing in them. And there's face masks. We have this one. And then we have a regular uh, avocado one. And we have two little things here. And then these drawers are empty too. And then we move on to the older sons. He is... I don't know what you call it because it's not college because he will be coming back. But he's just... I guess at boarding school or something. He's just at a place where I used to stay where I could say maybe it's a school with a dorm or something. So he has a gaming, gaming set up here. And then he has a little place where he can sit and play his video games. And then up here he has a bucket of where his video games are. 
and his bed and a little swimsuit for him. I'm getting more clothes for him, I promise, but this is his only swimsuit, like women clothing that I could find for him. Next is my favorite part, by far my favorite part, the nursery. I love building nurseries. I don't know what it is. It's just super fun because I just got a new baby pack and there's so much in it that is very cool and cute. So, first we have the ba bed and of course the baby here. Um, so yeah, I don't know if like, a boy or a girl because last time I had a baby I lost it first of all like I didn't like I lost it in Tokoboka it's somewhere and then uh and then I it had a little hair and I didn't know if that's because it was a girl so I don't know if that's a boy or a girl but I think it's a girl I don't know <laughs> so then we have her changing bed with some stuff for her butt too and then we have like I don't know what that is, baby oil or something. And then little wipes and little diapers. And then up here, we have more diapers because we're gonna have to change them. And then we have all of her toys. And I also love how there's like this background that matches perfectly with her bed. I thought that was very cute and just pretty. <laughs> So that's it for her nursery. It's very small and stuff, but it is very small and cute. And obviously we have her little lights and her little um, rug. And last room of the house is goes to the toddler. So first she has her closet of all of her toys and blocks. And then she, she has all of her clothes. So that's just a little thingy. And then she has pictures she drew and some pictures that her mom gave her of just pretty flowers, drinks, sunset, and lanterns. And then she has her bed and her little nightlight. And then these are her little main lights that she has. And she obviously has her little ladybug saying that she can ride around her room. So that is it for the tour and I hope you guys love this tour. And comment down below if I should add more things. And make sure you go check out the video that it's Nora made. It's a very cool video. I love it. And yeah, so 